this. Oh god, dude! A fish just swam up my trunks, dog. I'm not even lying, bro. What's up guys, it's Brandon J, and today we have a fun little video for you. I'm out on the river with my good friend Jake right here, just spending some time hanging out. And uh, we've got a new little addition to the crew. Her name is Treasure. It's Jake's little puppy. She's so freaking cute. <laughs> this is literally the cutest dog ever. I think I had dog slime on my face. She's gonna be joining us in our future River Treasure videos. She is now officially part of the River Treasure crew. Look, if you're gonna be part of the crew, you can't be eating shells, homie. You can't do that, spit it out. Spit it out right now. Drop it. Dro Good, she listened. Hey, pup. You are literally the cutest dog I've ever seen in my life. No, no more shells, you can't. <laughs> Gosh. So today's video is actually a really special one just because the other day I posted a River Treasure video where I said this. If we can get 5,000 likes on this video, I'm totally wearing these in my next River Treasure expedition. <laughs> and when I said that, I was just throwing a giant number out there just to kind of be funny. Um, I underestimated my supporters. I underestimated you guys, man. I had no idea that we were actually gonna get 5,000 likes on that video. So me being a man of my word, I'm gonna be making a video wearing these goggles today, doing my river treasure. It's gonna be tough. I haven't rubbed any of the river slime off these, so I can't see very well. And everything is coated in blue. So uh, it's gonna be a little bit rough, but uh, I'm up for the challenge. I'm up for the challenge, man. You guys have been showing me an insane amount of support. It's been really unreal and uh, I'm super appreciative of it. So, so with that being said, I'm gonna go ahead and hop in the water. I'm gonna put these little goggles on and try to find you guys some river treasure. This isn't a super serious video by any means. It's just me and Jake hanging out and I figured I'd go ahead and do this uh, little video with the <laughs> silly goggles that I found. So I appreciate the support on the videos. I really appreciate the 5,000 likes and uh, let's get to it, man. Let's find some river treasure. You're still chewing on that shell, huh? <laughs> treasure. <laughs> Got him. <laughs> Good luck, bro. <laughs> You're not getting that shell. Got her. Got him. All right, man. Let's go swim. Well, here goes nothing. <laughs> This is so much harder. Woo! This is rough. All right, guys, I just got out of the water. I wanted to show you this real quick. I can't believe we found this. We always said we would find one of these eventually just because they were such a big craze. The craze is kind of over now, but I found the remains of a fidget spinner right here. This is, uh, we, we knew we were gonna find one eventually. I think Jake actually found a uh, fidget cube a while back, but this is the first official fidget spinner. So that's super awesome. All right, I just wanted to share that with you guys real quick. That's super cool find. I'm about to get back in the water. Uh, we got a storm rolling through, so I got to find some lures fast.
So as I was diving, I actually found um, a rock that was covered in an old cast net. Stuff like this is like really, really hazardous to the river. Um, you know, turtles get trapped up in this stuff, fish get caught up in this, other people's lures and line get wrapped up in this and it just causes a big mess. So we always try to rip off as much as we can and make sure we throw it away because this stuff's bad. So, all right, let's get back in the water. All right, so I just hopped out of the water and using these goggles was an absolute disaster. It was so much harder than I anticipated originally. They kept filling up with water. They were just a pain. Treasure, do you think you could use the goggles? Huh? These could be your goggles. What do you think? What do you think? I don't think she's too interested. It was extremely challenging, but I'm a man of my word. I did dive with them on for a little bit, not the whole time, just because it was so extremely hard. Let me take these things off. <laughs> I seriously do appreciate you guys' support. It's been unreal lately. Um, let's go ahead and check out some of these lures though. All right, so this was pretty cool. On my first dive down, I actually found this little uh, rattle trap. It's actually in really good condition. Someone must have just lost this one. It's got really nice hooks on it still. This thing's a good lure. Also found quite a few swim baits today. We have this uh, nice snow white edition with the brown face. It's just brown because it's dirty. We have this one right here, which is pretty much its twin. And we have this crusty dude. So those are the swim baits I found. Found a weird, I don't even know if this is a lure. This is like a kid's toy. It says Shakespeare on it, so this is probably one of those like little starter rod lure packs. Got a little drop shot bait. A nice little minnow jerk bait. This, oh God. Dude, a fish just swam up my trunks, dog. I'm not even lying, bro. I, I swear to God it was a bluegill. I, I cannot make this up. Dude, that was so creepy. Oh, dude, I'm sitting right here on this edge. I swear to God that just happened. Yes, I was fully recording. I 100% just had a bluegill swim up my trunks. Dude, that was so creepy. Ew, that was weird, bro. I didn't like that. I didn't like that at all. Okay, back to, back to this. I found this weird lure that reminds me of like a, a chicken for some reason. Like it looks like a, uh, like a raw chicken, like a dead raw chicken. Got a little grub lure. These are always good for a skipjack. Uh, my favorite bait ever, a little rooster tail. It's in pretty good condition. I found this strange fluke. Has this like really weird like jig head. Look at this, look at that. Isn't that weird? It's like a weird, like I've never seen a jig head like that. Weird. Found two worms today, which is uh, interesting because normally we don't find worms out here. A lot of people don't use worms. The name's Jigging with Jordan. So of course I found a jig. <laughs> it's actually a pretty good one. It's like a black and blue like structure jig. It's pretty nice. Oh, I almost dropped it. Come here. Oh, no, I dropped it. Crap. I had two bullet weights, but now I only have one because I dropped one. I also found all of this. This is like rusted metal and a ton of fishing line. It has weights all up in it. It's got this one nice red crankbait in there. There's like just a whole bunch of just nasty stuff in here. So it's always good to get this kind of stuff out of the river. Like I said earlier about that net, it's like this stuff just ravels up and gets all tangled and like it's just it's just like a death trap for anything living in this river. So this is bad stuff. So I'm glad we got this out. 
All right, so that's it for today's video, man. It was a blast. The challenge was completed. I swam with those crazy goggles. That was a challenge in itself, even swimming with those on. So finding river treasure was even more challenging. But I had to do it because I'm a man of my word and you guys have been supporting the channel like crazy. It hasn't went unnoticed. I've been overwhelmed with all the support lately and I really do appreciate it. You know, you guys allow me to do what I love to do every single day. Uh, which is just it's just so cool man so i think that's going to be it for today i had a lot of fun out here diving me jake and uh, our new addition treasure a little pup down there we're about to uh you know put the cameras away just enjoy the day and do some uh, river boarding man yeah, water's water's about to rise here soon so we're gonna get those boards out i do appreciate you guys watching the videos it's been a uh, it's been a blast making for you guys so uh until next time peace Jake, your dog is cool and all, but she doesn't like water, dude. We gotta fix that. We do. <laughs> we really do. She doesn't like the water, which is it's pretty ironic. You got Mr. River over here, and his dog is like hydrophobic, dude. She's getting there. She's learning. She's learning. She'll be a beast soon. She'll be a straight up warrior very soon. <laughs> a river warrior. Hey, drop that shell. No. <laughs> got another one. <laughs>